it's really cool, you know, just to be able to know that, you know, every every kick, you know, uh, kind of came down to this one. There were a lot of memorable moments over the second weekend of college football, but only one was truly historic. That's when April Goss converted an extra point, building on a Kent State 29-6 lead in the second quarter versus Delaware State, becoming the second female to score a point in Division I football. To talk more about the special moment, we welcome in the trailblazer herself. April, what was going through your mind the moment coach called your number for that extra point attempt? Um, I, I just remember he called me, he told me, he had someone actually come talk to me and just tell me, okay, like, start getting ready. If we score again, you're going to kick. And, you know, I had kind of been warming up before that just to stay loose. And I just remember, like, going over to my teammates and just saying, like, guys, it's happening. Um, and then just, like, going over, when, like, getting ready to actually go out on the field. Um, just trying to stay calm, the most important thing. And just, you know, kind of saying um, a couple prayers, but, you know, just trying to stay focused and, and locked in. So you made history, but even for Trailblazers, there's room for improvement. Where do you feel like you can grow the most as a kicker for Kent State? Oh, um, absolutely. Like, improvement every single day. Um, you know, right now, there's a lot of technical errors. For my form, most importantly, just little kinks that I need to improve on and, um, you know, what everyone has those. So I think just working on those fundamentals. So you've been a member of the team now for four years. Was there a specific moment, because I'm sure there's some obstacles, but was there a moment when you felt like you were fully a member and fully accepted uh, by your teammates there at Kent State? Wow. Um, I don't know. I just remember, like, I kind of was preparing for them to, I guess, not accept me at first, to be very standoffish, to... You know, maybe be, I don't know, I guess not wanting a girl to come in and play. And from the very moment that I had my very first day with them, the very first tryout, they were so accepting and kind. And, you know, it was funny because there was like a hundred guys whose names I did not know. And they all be like, what's up, April? And just like, hey, dude. But, not smooth, you know. April. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, I feel like. There's always been times, and even now, I just, you know, there's those days where they just say something that makes you just feel, like, you know, proud and, and stuff like that. 